The energy upgrade is still very Neptunian. So what can you imagine in this Neptunian energy? What is your creative choice? This is really the question that is with us all for still another week or so. So it's the reminiscence of the eclipse as well as the full moon and how it is actually moving forward. Now, many years ago, I, I really resonated with the indigenous way of not asking for something, for instance, rain, because it's very dry here at the moment. The indigenous, they usually imagine the rain. They imagine how the trees receive the water, how the water is maybe the drops on their own skin. They can see the water, they can see the rain. And so it is very important in this Neptunian energy to tap into the magic not asking for the rain, not asking what benefits you, not asking for a new car, but actually imagining and using your creative choice for the magic. We live definitely in a world that is coming to an end, but it's not the end of the world, it's just the end of what we have known for thousands of years here on the planet. And so it is very important that you and I figure out in that Neptunian energy, it's not about illusion. This time it's actually about truth. But often the truth is magical. Often the truth is mystic. And so I'm inviting you into these fields of the possible and impossible. So what is this creative choice that you're making? What is the rain that you can see lightening up, watering, smelling the rain? What is that rain that you can see, that you can hear, that you can bring into our world at this time? This is what this energy is all about for this upgrade. And yes, I call it upgrade because each time the planets are moving and they're always moving, each time we're getting closer to this end of a cycle, not end of the world, which is a different thing. We are having an upgrade and this upgrade at this moment for us personally is related to the homo luminous, the new human of the heart from the operating system mind in the operating system heart into the intelligence of the heart that is naturally connected to the magic of nature which is not just the nature that i'm seeing outside and you're seeing in my back and the nature you know in your environment it is the elements much science is in nature and from nature, whether we're looking at the science of physics or biophysics or quantum physics or chemistry or astronomy or astrology, it is all within the magic of nature. How far are you outside the limiting matrix, the matrix of matter, and how far are you in the divine systems, infinite and boundless systems of this magic of nature? That is the question we have at this time. And there's about another week, another window for us to create the rain, not to ask for rain, but to ask for the beauty that rain brings, for the beauty that it brings for you and for me, for the beauty it brings to nature, to the whole cosmos, to the harmony and to love. 
So the sound bridge today, the light language that comes through, is about connecting you. What is your rain? What is your magic? What is your creative choice that you're bringing in at this moment? Not attached by your ego, what it may look like, but feeling it, hearing it, smelling it. Not for your own benefit, not for your gain, but for the collective evolution, for the collective consciousness, for the harmony in love, in which we all dance at this moment. So what is that? This bridge may take you today into your childhood. What did you love when you were little? You may have lost it on the way, or you may still know it very well. So let me take you there in this Neptunian energy. It's not about being a Pisces. It's not about anything like that. It is about you dancing to the rhythms of this Neptunian upgrade that is for all of us so let me tune in so that you can connect within you to your magic to make that creative choice to imagine what rain you are here to bring what it feels like what it sounds like, what beauty and what magic it brings to all. Pitare pitara mea namano. This is a time to live your dreams. Not only to talk about it, but to live them. Your dreams are not just for you. They are connected to the divine. They are a representation of your divine passion that takes you there. We all have this unique spark. So, what are you ready to imagine? What magic are you bringing through in this amazing time? And remember, you might leave something behind. You may let something go that no longer serves to be that magic that is coming now. Not tomorrow, it's not a process. It is happening here and now this is what miracles are all about and this is our neptunian energy for us this week see you all there can't wait for your comments can't wait for your experiences not your past experiences but the experience that you have right now see you there much love